everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jacqueline and I make new videos every week, a whole variety of things, lifestyle, beauty, adventure, all sorts of fun stuff. And I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. So if you consider subscribing and joining our little adventure family here. And welcome to a new vlog. I almost forgot what I was doing. Uh, whew, wow. Pregnancy brain is really getting to me sometimes. Anyway, um, welcome to a new vlog. It's a Monday. I'm one of those weird people who like loves a Monday. Um, I just feel like I get so much done on Mondays. So I already, it's the afternoon now. It's just past 12. I worked out. I edited a video, got it uploaded, um, put some laundry in, ran to the post office, um, took top for a walk, ate lunch, and I'm ready to get back to work. Um, but I want to share a couple like holiday e things with you guys. So um, I'll leave my holiday decorating video up in the corner and down below. One thing I didn't show you in that video that I think I've shared like every year, um, but I want to share it again, are these sensicles. So um, if you have a fake tree like we do, I would love to have a real tree, but my husband's not for them. But you, so you have a fake tree, but you really love the smell of a real tree. These things are great. Like I said, they're called sensicles. Um, I'll try to find them like, at like Lowe's or something, I'll link them down below. I just got these at um, the commissary, which is the grocery store on base. Um, so I'm sure you find them like a ton of places, but um, I always get two packs of these for our tree. Our living room is like open to our kitchen and stuff. So I feel like one's not enough, if that makes sense. So I like to get two different scents. I have um, Oh Christmas Tree, which is actually my favorite one. And I also have um, white winter fur, which smells pretty much like a, like a tree. <laughs> so um, yeah, they're just like these little, like these long, you kind of see them on the side of the bottle there. These long kind of like waxy um, green like sticks and you put hooks on them and you hang them in your tree and then your tree smells like a real Christmas tree. So like I said, if you're kind of missing that like real tree smell, these are great. Um, they say them last for 30 days. So I tend to hang mine up like after Thanksgiving. So they kind of last all the way through Christmas and stuff. But, um, yeah, I love these guys. I really think they work really well. I love, like, it doesn't like fill the room with a tree scent, but like when you like walk past it or are, like sitting near it or something, you can really smell it. So I like that. So, um, yeah, they're great. So if you're looking for something to make your room smell good. The other thing I found in the grocery store, which I love and I get every year, are the Ghirardelli peppermint bark squares. And usually they only have like milk chocolate or a bag with milk and dark chocolate mixed. And this year I found a bag exclusively with the dark chocolate one that I'm so excited about it because I love dark chocolate. Don't get me wrong, milk chocolate's good, but the dark chocolate's even better. So I love these things. I'm about to eat one. That's the reason I only have one out. But um, if you love like peppermint bark with chocolate, these are really good. So highly recommend if you can find the all dark chocolate ones. So, so good. Um, I think that's all I want to tell you right now. I just want to pop on, get the vlog started and tell you about those few things. So I'm going to get back to doing some work and I will just check in with you guys a little later. Okay. Good morning, everybody. It's Tuesday. I'm about to put some makeup on for filming purposes um and just for like the day in general and stuff but I wanted to kind of like just share with you what I was using and stuff so I'm gonna put on a YouTube video and just kind of fast forward I like to do this every once in a while on the vlogs just so you guys maybe if you don't watch my makeup videos but you want to see some makeup I don't know um I'm not sure how I feel about this shirt and hair combo but I'm hoping maybe once I put some makeup on it'll help me like feel like it all looks good together you guys, you guys ever do that? Like sometimes I like do my hair and get dressed and then I look at him and I'm like, just doesn't look right until I put on makeup. And then I put on makeup, I'm like, okay, everything's like pulled together and looks right now. So that's my plan. So I'm just gonna show you what I'm using and stuff. I'll fast forward through all this. But um, if you're curious about links to everything, they'll all be down below.
it was all done and actually now I'm liking like the hair and the shirt and stuff together. I told you that would happen. So I'm gonna put all this away and get to filming and I will just check with you guys a little bit later. I just feel like I talked for like 20 years. Um, I just filmed a cleansing balm video though and it was really, really fun. It's a, hopefully gonna be a great video. I've been working on testing these cleansing balms for a while now. But um, I'm gonna get to editing and I have some other work. I actually have to print a picture for an order to fulfill an order. Um, if you guys don't know, I'm a photographer. I have an Etsy shop and I'll leave it down below. I actually just put up seven new prints in my shop. So definitely go check it out if you're looking for like a good Christmas gift. There are some really pretty landscapes um, there. So definitely go check those out. But um, I'm gonna get to editing and I will see you guys. Like, oh, also I changed my top in case you were curious for my second video that I filmed in case you were like, is this a different day? No, this is still Tuesday. Just changed my top. Um, <laughs> but I'm going to go edit those videos. So I will see you guys later. Okay. Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday now. I'm just fishing and getting ready. I'm waiting for my hair to like settle down a little bit. I want to share a couple things with you. First of all, I tried this new mascara and I've been loving it. This is the Rummel uh, kind and free. It's brand new. I actually got it through Influencer. So in case you're curious, Influencer is like an app you can use and you can get free products for your reviews. So that's how I got this. So I didn't pay any money for it, but, um, they're not like paying me either to say any of this, but I do love it. It's mascara I have on today. I just think it's a really nice, pretty mascara and I've really, really been enjoying it. Um, the other thing I realized is that I haven't really like shown you guys my bump in my vlogs. Um, I am taking like video updates of each week. So there'll be like a video after I'm done being pregnant, but I figured I would show you guys my bump now. Please ignore my very dirty mirror. So I'm currently at 26 weeks. Um, like you can't really tell from the front that much. Like you can see a little bit, but you can definitely tell from the side now. Um, yeah, so I'm at 26 weeks. This is kind of what I'm looking at right now. Um, like I said, it's not... I thought I would be bigger. <laughs> I don't know. It's my first pregnancy. But um, yeah, like I said, like you can't really tell from the side or, or the front or the back. It's just the side pretty much. And it's only when I'm wearing like tighter clothes. Like if I have a baggy sweater on, it's harder to tell then too. But um, yeah, I have been like working out and stuff throughout my pregnancy. So I think that's helping. Um, and I'm kind of like right on track. So I just want to share with you guys here because I feel like I haven't. So there is my bump. Okay, I've since changed um, since you last saw me. But I filmed a video. I actually have a couple exciting packages coming today, so I can't wait to share those with you guys. But I'm just getting ready to take the puppy on a walk. So you can hear him down there yelling at me. Where is he? Tal, where are you? There he is. See him down there? Um, so yeah, that's kind of what's happening. I also took off my lipstick. I was like a good color, but I just like wasn't feeling it for all day, so... Um, but yeah, that's what's happening. So I'll probably check in with you guys when I actually get those packages. So I'll see you later. All right, so I got a couple of the packages I was waiting for. I hope the other one isn't getting delivered to the wrong house because they are both coming FedEx and one got dropped off and the other one didn't. So hopefully it's all right, I don't know. But the first couple things I got from Amazon, I want to share with you because I also want your recommendations. I got a couple parenting books and I wanted to know if you have any recommendations for like newborn parenting books that you highly recommend. The first one I got was Bringing Up Bebe. Um, I've heard a lot of great things about this and I was very curious so I decided to pick this up and I also got the classic what to expect in the first year. Um, I figured this would just be a good like reference to have around the house and stuff. Um, I feel like this is something like my husband could use too. So um yeah, I'm excited about those two things. I also got some thank you cards off Amazon. I'm trying to show you. These are just their Amazon basic like line, but they're just like plain thank you cards. They just say thank you. They have plain brown envelopes on them. They were like nine bucks for a set of 48. And I figured these would be great for um, thank you cards for like the registry and stuff. So I don't have to spend a ton of money on thank you cards, but I can kind of like write them as I get stuff. Um, the last thing I got is actually out in the hallway. Let me take you out there. Um, and I'm really excited about this. Uh, the car seat we wanted, oops, wrong light, sorry. The car seat we wanted was actually on sale. So we decided to pick it up ourselves and we're really excited about it. So let me show you which one we got. 
just noticed the box is a little damaged. Hopefully it's all right in there. But this is the Graco Snug Ride Snug Fit 35 DX L DLX. Um, so it's like the upgraded version of their normal Snug Ride Snug Fit. And it fits. I was very curious about it. That's for the baby buddy, not for you. Um, but it fits with our stroller. So we can just like clip this straight onto the stroller, which is nice. Um, so yeah, we're going to pull it out later, test it out with the stroller, get it at least so we can figure out how to get it into the car. But, um, yeah, we're really excited about this. It had some great reviews. So, um, yeah, we're pretty excited. It would, like I said, it was on sale. Good boy. Um, on Cyber Monday. So we picked it up cause it was such a good price. But like I said, I should have one more package coming. It should be an airy package. <laughs> I ordered more leggings. I've been like living in them and I just don't have that many that like fit me currently. And actually the pair I'm wearing today are feeling a little tight. So I just ordered a few more. I heard Ari had great leggings and they were 40% off on Cyber Monday. So I decided to pick a few pairs up. I figured I could return ones that I didn't like. Um, but like I said, they're supposed to come the same carrier as the car seat and they didn't come yet, so I'm hoping they're not getting delivered to a wrong house. I'd be so disappointed. Um, so, yeah, we will see what happens. I will keep you updated. I'm going to get back to doing a little bit of work, um, and that's it for now. Okay, package update. I um, can actually see, like, the road we live on from my office. I'm not like stalking these people. Like I can see them when I drive by when I'm working. The same girl who dropped off the stroller just dropped off my second package. I think she just like didn't realize they were the same house. So I'm gonna go grab it. I'll show you what I got. Um, I probably won't do like a try on or anything. Um, you'll probably see the stuff throughout videos if I decide to keep it. So I'm gonna grab that package and I'll show you what I got. Okay, so like I said, I ordered from Aerie. Sorry, the dog's tail is wagging. Here's some wagging. So the first thing I got was this uh, crop top. This is part of their offline brand thing. And it's like a little crisscross. I got it in a size medium. I'm hoping it will like fit over my breast and my baby bump right now. <clears throat> and then I got this bra too. It actually matches a pair of leggings that I purchased. I don't know if the leggings are going to fit or not though. They feel pretty tight. So we'll see. But um, again, I got it in a medium, hoping that it would fit me. And then this I got in a large. I don't have any like good tank tops to wear over my bump right now. And I feel like I needed some layering pieces. So I got this in a large and I figured it'd be really cute oversized once I'm not pregnant. So um, yeah, I'll have to try obviously all of this on. But those are the tops I got. Okay, and then these are the leggings I got. So these are the ones that match that bra I was just showing you. Like I said, I don't know if that band's going to be too tight on my tummy or anything, but I got these all in mediums. They have a cute little detail here. These are their OG offline leggings. So these ones aren't high rise. Um, so, and they were fairly inexpensive, so we'll see. These are the offline ones as well, but they are the high rise ones. And then these are the ones I'm most excited about. They actually feel a lot like my Lululemons. Um, and they were... Definitely a lot cheaper than Lululemon's. Um, and they have a like, little crossover. So I have a feeling these ones will fit great. These ones um, don't feel like Lululemon. I'm hoping they have a good stretch to them though. Just this material on this one feels a ton like Lululemon. So um, yeah, I'm excited to try them on. We'll see what fits and what doesn't. I'll let you know what I end up keeping. All right, just turn everything on. As suspected, these green leggings are the winner oh my gosh they are so soft so comfortable i gotta see what other ones are like made with this material because the other ones i didn't like the, like the material that they're made out of and then unfortunately these were just too tight like i suspected so the other three legs are all going back but i'm gonna keep all the tops because they all fit really well i actually really love this it's got like a built-in sports bra um, and this is so comfortable and the other two tops are really comfortable. So I'm going to keep this one pair of leggings and those two tops and maybe see if I can get this legging in black because they are so comfortable. So maybe I can get these pair instead of those three. So that's kind of the plan. But wow, these green ones are really comfortable. I'm really happy with these ones. All right, it's Thursday now. It's been a busy morning. Uh, it's actually the afternoon now, it's 1.30, um, but I got my workout in, made some breakfast, and then me and Matt actually are taking 
um, birthing class. It's virtual through the hospital that I'll be giving birth in. Um, so, and it was, it definitely had a lot of good information. It was just interesting because usually I guess it's taught by two nurses and one of the nurses is a little bit more tech savvy than the one today. And uh, we had a lot of technical difficulties. So a lot of the class was spent trying to figure, her trying to figure that out. Um, but uh, hopefully the other ones go a little bit smoother. But like I said, it was full of like good information and a lot to think about. And definitely me and Matt need to have some conversations about like what we expect from birth and what I need from him while I'm giving birth and all that stuff. Um, so definitely some interesting information. And I feel like um, some of it I already knew because I've been reading a lot of like pregnancy books and stuff. And some of it obviously Matt didn't know because he hasn't been reading those books like I have. So it was definitely interesting um, and definitely learned some interesting facts and stuff. So it was good. Um, and then we ate some lunch together. He had to go obviously back to work. Um, I took Tahoe for a walk. And then I've been working on editing a video that won't be live until after Christmas. I'm trying to like slowly pre-film instead of all pre-filming like the week before my family comes. Just like picking one video that I need to pre-film and doing it like slowly, like one a week before my family comes. Um, and before we take like a break for Christmas and stuff because I plan on putting up Hopefully I'll put up vlogs still um, throughout Christmas break, like when my family's here and Matt's family's here. But in terms of other videos, I don't want to have to like edit or do any administrative work or anything like that for them. So I'm trying to like get them all done and up in my channel, like just scheduled to go up on the day they're supposed to go live, which will feel so good to like have done and out of the way and not have to worry about them. So I've been working on editing that video and then I'm just waiting for an Amazon package because I need to make a print to ship out and I need, I really want to ship it out tomorrow. It technically doesn't need to ship out until next week, like Monday or Tuesday, but I would obviously like to get it shipped out earlier. Um, someone, you know, paid for this print and if I can get it shipped out as soon as possible, I would love to do that. Um, I just didn't realize I was out of a certain color ink. I thought I had enough to make this print and I didn't. So um, I had to order some ink really quickly from Amazon. So it should be here today. So I should be able to print it and then I just have to um, mat it and pack it tomorrow morning really quickly and get it off to the post office. So that's kind of the plan for that. But um, yeah, it's just been a really busy morning and day. And, but it's beautiful out. It's like 70 something outside, which is so weird for December. We're like 25 degrees above average, which is not great, but it is really nice out. So I took Tahoe for a walk and that was nice, but um, yeah, it's just weird, weird weather. So um, I actually don't have too much more to do now, um, but I just wanted to check in and let you guys know what was happening since I hadn't been on all day. Cause like I said, it's just been one of those busy mornings but I do have the new um airy stuff on and oh this is so comfortable my husband is like oh that's cute I like those they're so comfortable so nice to work out in and I love them so I have to go return a few other things I might see if they have a couple more of these things in stock um at the store to get like one more pair of like I would love a pair of black ones like this and maybe one more of these crop tops because these are so comfortable um but yeah, that's what's happening. And I will just see you guys a little bit later. All right, I'm going to end the vlog here. We had a pretty chill weekend. I just cleaned the house on Friday and then I baked some cookies, which I actually filmed like a bake with me video. So if you're curious about that, um, it should be coming up on my channel soon. So definitely subscribe and stay tuned for that. Um, we looked at some furniture for the baby's room, which I didn't vlog because I wasn't like thrilled with anything we saw. So we've been looking online. There might be something online that we'll get because we need like a dresser for the room. Um, and other than that, we just kind of chilled and hung out. So it was a pretty relaxing weekend, which was nice. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here, like I said. Hopefully you guys had a great week. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. I have a goal of thousand subscribers. So I would love to have you guys join our little adventure family. We would love to have you. And yeah, I think that's it for this video. So I will see you in my next adventure.